uh, knuckleheads on the run after allegedly targeting a box of frozen lobster tails and a theft at the Costco located on 41 in Fort Myers. Oh, wow, a local. Yeah, the suspect walked into the Costco and proceeded to the frozen food section. Then he picked out a box of delicious frozen lobster tails. Yum. And when no one was watching, stashed the seafood under his sweatshirt. Wow. Hope oh. it don't smell like pit stains. Right. Has anyone checked the butter section? <laughs> I mean, that's where I would head next. Because you could have some melted butter. Right. For your lobster tails. Right. I would just... Somebody go check the dairy section. Check the butter. They do uh, have big tubs of butter, too. Knucklehead in Colorado stands accused of stealing over $30,000 worth of underwear from various apartment complexes' laundry rooms. What? The, the thief was caught with his pants down, but don't worry, he's well covered. This <laughs> guy was almost ready to open his own Victoria's Secret. $30,000 worth of underwear. That's enough to buy a car with. What? Yes, I'd like to buy this Toyota Camry. Do you guys take boxers or briefs? <laughs> a lot of undies. And a knucklehead in Texas has been arrested for biting his girlfriend's nose after finding out that she had been working at a gentleman's club. Investigators say David Morin Jr., moron, uh, 34 years old, broke into the woman's apartment through a window at about 1 a.m. after she was ignoring several of his phone calls from him during the day. Well, yeah, she's busy. She's working on the pole. If he hadn't been so nosy, this never would have happened. Oh, my god! In response, she whacked him with a rolled-up newspaper and sprayed him with water. Wow. Hopefully, he'll be a good boy. Did I bite her no? Oh, my gosh. Those are your knuckleheads. Find those stories wherever you follow us on social media. Just search Mel and Scott in the morning. All right, me too. I don't think it's her nose that the guys are looking at. <laughs> I was going to say. She's up there on the pole. Just saying. <laughs>